Hello friends, in this video, I am going to discuss the Rights of Persons with Disabilities Act 2016. The Rights of Persons with Disabilities Act 2016 replaces the Persons with Disabilities, Equal Opportunities, Protection of Rights and Full Participation Act 1995. This Act is legislated to fulfill the obligations to the United Nations Convention on the Rights of Persons with Disabilities, to which India is a signatory member. This Act came into force in December 2016. Now, the question is, what is objective of the Rights of Persons with Disabilities Act? The Act is legislated with the objective to empower the persons with disabilities as respect for inherent dignity, individual autonomy, including the freedom to make one's own choices and independence of person, non-discrimination, full and effective participation and inclusion in society, Respect for difference and acceptance of persons with disabilities as part of human diversity and humanity. Next, equality of opportunity, accessibility, equality between men and women, respect for the evolving capacities of children with disabilities and respect for the right of children with disabilities to preserve their identities. Now, the question is, what is meaning of person with disability under this act? Person with disability means a person with long-term physical, mental, intellectual or sensory impairment, which in interaction with barriers hinders his full and effective participation in society equally with others. Now the question is, what is meaning of person with benchmark disability in this act? As defined in this act, person with benchmark disability means a person with not less than 40% of specified disability as certified by the certifying authority. Now, the question is, what are the disabilities covered under this act? Following are the major physical disabilities covered under this act. Blindness, low vision, leprosy cured persons, locomotor disability, cerebral palsy, dwarfism, mental illness, intellectual disability, autism spectrum disorder, hearing impairment deep and hard of hearing. Next, muscular dystrophy, a specific learning disabilities, chronic neurological conditions, multiple sclerosis, thalassemia, Multiple disabilities including deaf, blindness, hemophilia, sickle cell disease, acid attack victim, Parkinson disease, and a speech and language disability. Now, the question is, what are the rights of persons with disabilities? As defined in Section 3.1 of this Act, the appropriate government shall ensure that the persons with disability enjoy the right to equality, life with dignity, and respect for his or her integrity equally with others. Further, Section 7 of this Act defines that the appropriate government shall take measures to protect persons with disabilities from all forms of abuse violence and exploitation. Further, Section 25.1 of this Act ensures that the appropriate government and the local authority shall take necessary measures for the persons with disabilities to provide free health care in the vicinity, especially in rural areas, subject to such family income as may be notified. 
barrier free access in all parts of government and private hospitals and other healthcare institutions and centers and priority in attendance and treatment further section 312 of this act states that the appropriate government and local authorities shall ensure that every child with benchmark disability has access to free education in an appropriate environment till he attains the age of 18 years as matter of his rights defined in section 311 of this act further section 321 states that all government institutions of higher education and other higher education institutions receiving aid from the government shall reserve not less than 5% seats for persons with benchmark disabilities further clause 2 states that the person with benchmark disabilities shall be given an upper age relaxation of 5 years for admission in institutions of higher education last but not the least section 89 states that any person who contravenes any of the provisions of this act or of any rule made there under shall for first contravention be punishable with fine which may extend to 10000 rupees and for any subsequent contravention with fine which shall not be less than 50000 rupees but which may extend to 5 lakh rupees so this is all about the rights of persons with disabilities act 2016